Assalamu alaikum. Today we're going to talk about the character of trustworthiness. We all know the story of our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, that he was known as a sadiq al -Amin. We know that the people of Mecca used to trust him with their uh, belongings, um, that they trusted everything that he said. Yet when the time came for him uh, to become a prophet of Allah, and he went to his people and gathered them and said, if I told you there was an army on the other side of that hill coming to attack us, would you believe me? And they said, of course we would believe you. You always tell the truth. And he said, and if I told you that I was a prophet of God and that I was commanded to bring you to the worship of only one God, Allah, would you follow me and would you believe me? And they would not. Although they continued to leave their goods with him and to believe him in all other matters of lesser importance, they would not follow him. So what is the message that we have to learn from this story today? The message is that Allah commands us to always be truthful and trustworthy, as we, as we know that Rasulullah was. To always tell the truth, even if it is not to our advantage just as Rasulullah did. And we know that he suffered tremendously for telling the truth throughout his life. What are some things that we can do as individual Muslims to make sure that we always tell the truth and that we're always trustworthy? Well, first of all, we always should make dua and ask Allah to help us in being truthful and always telling the truth. Uh, we can work very hard, especially in this month of Ramadan. It makes it much easier for us because we know that shaitan and the devils are chained up in hell. So any lies or untruthfulness that we find within ourselves, we know is really evil within ourselves. And we can work hard to eliminate that. We need to make dua and ask Allah to help us. We need to um, always uh, remember to tell the truth, to um, bite our tongue even if we find ourselves tempted uh, to say something that's not true, to reward ourselves for every day that we go without telling a lie. And we're not talking about hurting someone's feeling by saying, you know, I don't like your dress or I don't like your tie. We're not talking about that kind of thing. But we need to work hard to train our souls away from telling lies. Um, and in this way, um, inshallah, we'll become more like Rasulullah and become always truthful and trustworthy, inshallah.